Hello, do you know that editing photos in Photoshop is very tiresome and time consuming? I have found out a software that you can simply use to edit your photos quickly and faster with just a single click. Are you doubting me? Let me show you how I can edit this very image from looking like this to looking like this, including the skin retouching and color grading with just a single click. So let me first of all come and I reset everything and I click on this first preset action. And you can see it is doing this in real time and within a few seconds the image is going to be retouched and color graded and everything is going to be fixed and right now the image has been retouched with just a single click you can see the before and after and in order to download this software i'll show you how you can easily download and install it to your computer when it comes to photography and retouching and editing photos quickly and faster so let me show you how you can easily install this to your computer and later on how you can create this beautiful preset to edit many photos as a photographer and deliver on time so simply come right here to your browser and simply type in may to young you so the spelling for this is going to be m e i t u y u n x i u and it's going to bring this website so click on the download option so click on it and it's going to take you to another page but you have to download the software regarding the type of system that you're using in case you're using windows you have to choose the windows option and in case you're using apple or ios or the macbook click on the Apple option to download and install it once you're done installing this software it is going to take you to this page whereby you have to import or where you can import your projects or your photos so you can click on the plus icon to import the photos and you can as well sign up after installing this so when you sign up this is going to be the page so the page is going to be containing your details your email address and the number of photos that you have to edit or the credits that you have so in case you want to get these credits for free and have a little bit of this you can simply use the link in the description of this video or in the comment section to get 20 free edits for your photos and you can simply get it at a discount by using the code in the description or in the comment section of this video so this is the interface so to import the images simply click on the plus icon to import the photos into the may 2 software and mine are already imported so i'm just going to click on my project double click on it to open up the project you can see before and after so i'll just simply reset this and i show you how you can easily use this software to edit and deliver your photos so in case you are a wedding photographer and you always have so many photos or so many photos for your studio work i'll show you how you can incorporate this kind of software to edit and deliver photos on time and this is going to help you make a lot of money as a photographer so let me show you how you can do this we are just going to come and uh, first of all close the presets panel and simply come to this option so you can see the software is going to basically identify whether this is a male subject or a female subject so for this we're just going to come to the acne option and remove the blemishes on the face by moving the slider so all you have to do is simply click and drag the sliders forward like that and you can as well protect the moles in case you want to protect the moles in the image and you're just going to come body blemishes and take that forward to remove the blemishes on the body and come and remove the forehead wrinkles and you can remove the dark circles and the wrinkles around the eye you can remove the cheek lines and move this slider for the smile lines click on the lip line option and in case you have lip lines you can remove those you can as well eliminate the neck wrinkles and the double chin so in case you want to come and do the skin retouching open up the skin option and you can start to have the the neutral gray leveling option and basically this is going to do the micro dodging and burning you know in photoshop this can take hours and hours trying to do the micro dodging and burning and right here all i have to do is simply come to the option of the neutral grow neutral gray leveling and simply move this forward and this is going to do the micro dodging and burning within few seconds so i'm just going to come and come to the neutral gray contour option to do the dodging and burning to create shape or dimension 
to the model's face or body. And I'm just going to come to the frequency separation. You know, frequency separation takes some time trying to perfect the skin. So for this, I, all I have to do is move the slider forward. And this is going to smoothen the skin. And you can simply come and you reduce on the smoothening effect in case it's too much for your liking. So I'll just go with 89. And you can even do the same for the body. So this was for the face. I'll come to the body option and I move this forward like that. And simply come to the skin texture for the face and move this in case I want to increase or intensify on the textures in the face. And in case the effect is not enough for you, you can even add some AI retouch on the face to smoothen the face even more or even better so you can see what we have right now you can see before and after before after by simply moving these small sliders you have been able to smoothen the skin so we're just going to come to the skin tone option and and in this you can brighten the skin whiten the skin and what i love most about this simply is coming to the skin tone balance option and you can balance the skin tone or the colors on the face and as well balance those on the body and you can even balance both on the face and the body so i've just come to this for the face and move this forward and for the body and for a better looking skin tone i'll just come to the mouth for skin tone balance and um, i move this forward and this is going to do the color grading and it's going to create even skin color or skin tones with just moving a simple slider let's just wait for this to happen you can see the before after before after we are now done retouching the image and you can as well come and whiten the eyes and the teeth by choosing these options and you can whiten the teeth in case you have the teeth and you can as well come the eye option and remove the reds or the redness from the eyes and remove those veins that are always existing within the eyes and you can as well come to the makeup option and simply enhance the makeup and do a little bit of eyebrow enhancement you can even enhance the eye makeup and simply come and enhance the makeup on the lips then you are going to come and even do a little bit of liquify on the body in case you want to reshape the body you can say before and after so this has been done by just moving sliders so let me show you how to save the preset simply come to the new preset option and click on it and you can rename the preset to what you want. So you're just going to name this to Chronix Retouch, like that. And after that, you can as well assign it to a group. So I'm just going to assign it to my own group and click on Save. And this preset is going to be saved. You can see it has saved the preset. So in case you have a multiple or number of photos that you want to edit, open up the preset option and you can see the preset was saved right there so in case i want to edit for example this very image i'll just come to it and simply click on the Ronix retouch preset and it's going to automatically do the retouch you can see processing retouching at 70 and now it is done retouching in this very image you can see before and after so in case you want to edit multiple images all you have to do i'm just going to reset this all you have to do with the edited image selected simply come and select other images by holding down the command or the control button and select the other images that you want to edit and you can simply click on synchronize or you can simply click on the preset that you want so i'm just going to come and click on synchronize and choose the options that i want and click on confirm and this is going to start retouching these images that i've selected automatically without having me stress and take a lot of time trying to retouch this very image and you can, you can see for the images that it is done editing it creates this pen icon and that is going to be very nice and beautiful to see so let's wait for the results and like i said in less than a minute you are going to be able to retouch more than five images so you can see this image has now been edited or retouched and you're waiting for just the last image and it is also done so you can see this image has been retouched you can see before after before after let me try to zoom in and i show you the effect you can see the image before and after before and after and in case you want to make adjustments or corrections if if the effect is too much 
you can as well come back to these adjustments and you correct or reduce the effect to your taste or to your liking. So I'm just going to reduce that and try to reduce on the skin retouching or the frequency separation or the AI option because that looks a little bit overdone. So this is how we can do this by using the action and make the editing process even better. And by the way, this is not only about retouching. We can as well do advanced features using this software. So for example, we can come and we use the clean backdrop or we can even come and clean the backdrop or the background by coming. So you, you can see that we are initially in the retouching option. You can come to the background option and you can simply come to the retouch option and we clean up the background. You can see we have a little bit of folds and wrinkles in the background. So by moving the clean background option or slide that is going to remove the wrinkles. So I'm just going to slightly zoom in so that I can show you what it has done. You can see before we had wrinkles around the all folds and by just moving a slider, we have been able to remove those wrinkles from the background. So let me show you the other thing this can do. When it comes to the background, you can as well change the background color in case you want to change the background color. So for this, simply come and choose any color that you want. You can choose white, red, or you can even choose a different color. Or you can as well come to the custom option and you can move this around your taste or to your liking just like that. And you can see how this is going to be affecting uh, the image and you can even as well add it to be more of a gradient color or a gradient feel and you can see how it has created that beautiful glow to my background so i'm just going to choose a red one so that you can see how beautiful this is going to transform your images as a photographer and by the way you can not only change the background you can as well come and simply remove the stray hair or the fly away hairs from your image. So in order to remove these fly away hairs, remember this can take so much time when it comes to Photoshop and other software. So in order to remove these fly away hairs, you can simply come to our options and we try to remove all these fly away hairs from uh, the image. So we're just going to come back to this and scroll down to come to the retouching panel and scroll down to the hair option. So when it comes to the hair option, I'm just going to get it to the hair option and I show you how it is going to be able to remove all these fly away hairs from the image. So I'm just going to look for hair. Here we are right now. So you can set it as the stray hair option. And for this, simply click on this stray hair option and move this forward like that and you can see by just moving a slider all the hairs are gone so this would have taken you so many minutes about 40 minutes or a lot of time trying to figure out and remove the stray hairs but this has been done with just a single movement of a slider and by the way you can even come and process the raw images in case you want to process raw files by simply coming to the adjustments and coming right here to the tone option and you can adjust the exposure and contrast like we have in other software so this is going to be all you have to do is simply download this so in case you want to download this simply check the link in the video description or in the comment section or you can as well fill up the google document linked in the comment section and in the description of this video and you'll get 20 free credits for editing your photos so you're good you're going to be getting that for free as a photographer and you try this out to enhance and you can see how beautiful this is going to make your workflow be when it comes to retouching and delivering quickly so it can as well edit subjects in this case quickly and better so in case you have multiple images or multiple people, simply click on your preset, click on it, and it's going to automatically do the work for you. So I'm just going to let it run, and you can see it is editing all this. So in Photoshop, 
this would have taken so many hours because you have to retouch each individual person alone and you have to do everything alone so this would have taken so much time when you're trying to do it in photoshop but for this case you can see it is done retouching the subject you can see before after before and after and in case it is too much like i said you can always come and reduce on for example this multiple balance option so that it can look better and more realistic before and after and by just moving a slider you have been able to retouch multiple people so in case you want to do this you can always do this quickly and faster and deliver your images faster as a photographer so in order to download this i showed you how you can download it and you can as well check the link in the comment section or in the video description to download this and after signing up for this software simply fill up the document that is provided in the link of the video as well and after filling it up you're going to be getting 20 free credits and by using the link or the discount code that is provided as well in the link you can as well get a discount or a 15 percent discount as a photographer to make your editing or workflow even better stop spending so much time trying to do the screen retouching and delivering your photos you can all do this with just a single click like i've showed you don't forget keep practicing and enjoy this may to software that is better than so many softwares out there don't forget keep practicing and as well keep creating and keep it made too